Ready the oars! The helm's all yours, Commander! Entering open water, Commander! Oars in! Full sail! I remember Mother's stories of Hira and the sacred wars. I wonder if she ever came here. How was Megaris? The wolf is dead. Excellent. 
the full amount as promised. You expected me to haggle? Come now, Alexios. It isn't every day I have someone kill their own father. But he wasn't your real father, was he? Why did you send me to kill Nikolaus? Because I knew you could. Oh, why him? Because he was brilliant. He would have taken Athens in a month, two at most. And Stentor doesn't have the wolf's genius. Uh, you wanted to save Athens? There's no profit in a quick war. I know, I know. It's a lot to take in all at once. Come. Tell me, Mistyos. Did you learn anything worthwhile in your dealings with the wolf? I'm done talking. I should kill you where you stand. Temper, temper. Ah, and they said you'd be different. But blood is blood, I suppose. They? What blood? You really are more brawn than brains, aren't you? A shame. I could have used you for more of my errands. Malaka! You think you can play with me? I'll cut out your tongue! So disappointing. Get out of my sight! Fight or die! Fight or die! Fight or die! Fight or die! Snuck away like a coward. I should investigate his house. A letter to Alpinor. Oh, Phoebe. You led him right to me. Alpinor's looking for a woman. I wonder who he wants in his slimy grasp now. This is a ship manifest. Elpinor selling weapons to both Athens and Sparta. He wants this war to go on forever. I have met some treacherous people. None of them compare to Elpinor. I'm going to look under every rock, in every shadow, until I find and kill this vile serpent.
hope this oracle gives better news than the one in Sparta. The Sanctuary of Nerfi. The gods themselves watch over this land. Alexios, isn't this remarkable? We're so close to the gods, I can feel Apollo all around me. How did it go with Elpino? We can talk later in private. Who's this? Just a simple pilgrim. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? She left me with more questions than answers. That's the oracle for you. may have mentioned you. I would appreciate you showing a bit more secrecy. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends. Like you. I, I thought you might get along. How did... You know my spear just by looking at it? You're more than some simple pilgrim. All things in Delphi are more than they appear. Even I. My name is Herodotus. I'm a storyteller. Or I was. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. <laughs> that much is true. Why are you hiding your identity? I'm here on behalf of a man in Athens. A very powerful man. We intend to finally end this war. You told me you came to ask the Oracle a personal question. War is personal, Barnabas. So, you came to seek the Pythia's guidance on how to end the war? I did. Though something is wrong in Delphi. Guards at every turn, people being turned away. You don't seem convinced the Pythia can be believed. What did she tell you? I asked her to show the path to the war's end. She said, Spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I don't understand a word of it, but that's why she's in there and we're out here. I know a threat when I hear one. <laughs> You were on Kefalonia for too long. This line is ridiculous. Are there always this many people to see the Pythia? These are more than just people. Every city sends a Fiori, or sacred ambassadors, to seek guidance on behalf of their people. The Pythia not only shapes the destinies of individuals, but of the entire Greek world. Imagine what power one would have if they controlled what came out of her mouth. Apollo controls this. Of course he does. Delphi is nothing like they say. Has it always been like this? No. This was once an open and welcoming place. But war changes things. People seek out the Pythia for more political reasons. Prophecies in times of war often stir violent emotions. It's wise to keep your blades sheathed. Drawing blood in Delphi is considered an insult to Apollo. Punishment is severe. I have my own questions for the Pythia. But this line... I'll be an old man by the time I see her. <laughs> You're joking! You carry more blades than a field of grass! I didn't come here to start trouble. Trouble?! Just walk in! Who's going to stop you? The priest? <laughs> All right. But if things get out of hand, I'm blaming you, Varnavas. Is he not every bit as great as I said? Ah. <gasps> huh. 
I'm here to see the Pythia. Only those chosen by the light of Apollo may enter. How does one get chosen? One goes to the back of the line. Do I look like someone who waits in line? Enter into the light of Apollo, the light that illuminates shadow. Choose your question wisely, mortal, for you have but one. Speak, truth seeker! I lost my mother when I was young. I have to find her. Where is she? It's you! From the visions! The child on the mountain! How could you know that? You need to leave. Now. Leave? Do you have any idea what I've been through to get here? Oh, but I do. There is wisdom in your decisions. Any other Mystheos would have killed those people in that cave in Megaris. But you held back for the truth and balanced judgment with their lives. But how? No one can hide from the light. Please. I've come this far. You must have the answers I seek. Child of the mountain, the cult of Cosmos have eyes everywhere. They will kill you. Cult of Cosmos? The Oracle has spoken! The prophecy is yours! You never answered my question! The Pythia is done for the day. I'm not leaving until I get answers! Rotatos, you're still here. Where's Varnavas? He's gone back to your ship. You don't look happy with your prophecy. She... knew who I was. <laughs> She's the Pythia. It's her business to act like she knows you. That was no act. She said she had visions of me as a child on a mountain. What child hasn't stood on a mountain? I was thrown from that mountain. My life started and ended on that mountain. I'm telling you. She knew who I was, what I'd done. Tried to warn me. Warn you? About what? She mentioned the cult of Cosmos. Does this mean anything to you? I'd heard whispers. A cult unlike any other coming to their feet. But I paid them no mind. The Pythia seemed afraid of them. Guards took her away. Took her away? Then the whispers were true. If this cult has corrupted the Pythia... This is devastating news. Do you understand what this means? Through her, the cult controls the world. I need to speak with her. When she's not so well protected. That would require a miracle from the gods. She is always protected. You know more about the Pythia than I do. Where would she be? When she's not in the temple of Apollo, she's at her home in the Hora of Delphi. I can't go breaking down every door until I find her. The Oracle's home is probably easy enough to spot. She'd be the only person in the Hora of Delphi who can afford to live in luxury. Where in the Hora of Delphi does the Pythia live? I've heard she lives on the outskirts of the village, but be warned, she will be guarded. Not everyone comes to see the Oracle with the best of intentions. I'll find where the Pythia lives. And I will get answers. Alexios, don't forget. Brute force is useless when finesse is required. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oracle is hiding inside. I'll finally get some answers. Better stay hidden. That's a lot of protection for the Pythia. I just want answers. The Pythia is a sacred vessel of the gods. People travel the world for my answers. But none of them would dare break into my home. Apollo's wrath will be cruel and swift. Guards! Enough with your lies. Tell me what I want to know. I can't... breathe. If you raise your voice, if you tell a lie, I will cut your throat. I'm dead already. They'll find out you were here, and they'll kill me for it. Who? This cult of Cosmos? Speak! Yes, the cult wants you dead. They know you're here. 
What is this cult of Cosmos? They are the eyes that see, but go unseen. Enough with the riddles. I want names. I don't know. I swear. They hide behind masks and shrouds. Why would you work for the cult? I have no choice. So, all those prophecies from the gods, all those people, you're paid to deceive them all? Most want to know about love or death. I tell them what they want to hear. But when people want to know about war or politics, I'm paid very well to tell them what the cult wants them to hear. You said you saw me in your visions. What did you see? There is an artifact under the Temple of Apollo. It reveals what only the gods should know. You called me the child on the mountain. The cult hunts a Spartan child who survived the terrible fall from Mount Taietos. The artifact revealed that child to be you. You have an opportunity to do the right thing. Tell me where to find the cult. Tell me where they are, or we'll go find them together. Beneath the Temple of Apollo there is an ancient chamber. I think they meet there. But without one of their cloaks and masks, you won't make it more than two steps inside. Where can I find one of these cloaks and masks? There is a man. He visits me from time to time, makes sure I'm well taken care of. I have the biggest house in the Hora of Delphi, yet he still offers Drachmi for my troubles. Gives me the creeps. What's his name? Elpinor. Elpinor? He's with the cult? I can't be sure, but if he is, he would definitely have what you require. Any idea where I can find him? There is a fort just south of the Valley of the Nymph. He's been known to conduct business there. You've been helpful. Now get out of my house! For using finesse. I should tell Herodotos what the Pythia told me about the cult. Maybe he'll have some insight. Well, what did the Pythia tell you? The cult of Cosmos is hunting me, but I'm going to hunt them first. She told me they meet in a secret chamber under the Temple of Apollo. So it's all true. If the cult has done anything, it's fooled this old man. I can't get in without a mask and cloak. It's how the cultists identify each other. The Temple of Apollo is by the Cave of Yea. Simple enough to find. But a cultist's mask and cloak? How will you accomplish that? The Pythia gave me the only clue I need. When I'm ready, I'll meet you at the temple. For now, I'm going to kill Elpinor, Malaka's liar. There will be trouble if I'm spotted here.
Fuck him. Fuck. What's your problem? What don't I have fucking problems with? The Oracle for one, the sea for another, and don't get me started on my crew. You have business with the Oracle? You're a long way from Delphi. Had business. And my business is none of your fucking business. I ain't shopping for a merc. If anything, I need the gods. If you want something done, you'll have to do it yourself. <laughs> You're right there. Can't trust the gods or their servants. So, who are you? Captain Yellon of the Shark's Tooth. Shark Tooth's your boat? Do I look like a fucking fisherman? I sail a ship, not a boat. Malaka, I came to see if you needed help. Fuck you. No one asked you to. You know what? Fuck you. <sighs> okay, sorry. Been a bad day. I finished my business with the Oracle and was meant to meet my ship here. They're nowhere to be fucking found, and I've been here since last night. So, you sought the Oracle's advice? Her? Pfft, fuck no! I'd rather seek counsel in the wind from my ass. Then why seek her out? We got a deal. I suppose no harm in telling you. She lets me know where the pilgrims are coming from. Then I supply the transport for their journey, and we split the fee. So you're trying to tell me the Oracle has divine intuition of where the pilgrims will be coming from? <laughs> Fuck no. She asks her believers how full the ports are. Then she tells me. Simple. You have business here in Fokis? I got business everywhere. Right now, it's where's my fucking ship? So where's the shark's tooth? I wouldn't fucking be here if I knew, would I? Okay, let me rephrase. Where was the crew meant to be? Well, um, I sent my girl Yiki off. Pilgrims get stuck in the shallows around here, and uh, we sort of help out. Oh, your girl? Yeah. Best hand I ever had, and more. Look, find my ship and my Yiki, will you? I'll pay. I'll find out what happened and bring them back. Do you know where they could have gone? The southeastern shore is pretty rich pickings. Nice cove there to trap lost, wealthy pilgrims. You're a pirate. What if I fucking am? I'm the pirate that's paying you. Anyway, I'm not a pirate all the time. It's more of a hobby. A hobby? You sure the crew didn't mutiny and run off on you? Not with my Yiki at the helm. Plus, they never got the cut from our last trip. They wouldn't leave without getting paid. Describe Yiki. She's beautiful, she is. Kisses like summer. From the first time I saw her, I wanted to eat her all up. Not helpful? Okay, okay. She's raven-haired, and has a precious band on her arm that I gave her. Always wears it. I'll find them and return as soon as I can. Off we go. Ah, Fobo ne prokalis. Ah. Ella. Zebro ne. Akopteni sa. Es chorodes ti tu to. Tu de bo bo te apodera. Yeah. Come on. Yeah! Oh, 
warned me of snakes in the grass, but I wasn't expecting this. Come on! <laughs>
see that asshole? Nothing. Think they ran off? Keep looking. They're here somewhere. On it! We'll get them! Tell me if you see anything. No, I've lost them. For now. Well, keep looking. Don't worry, the fun's just beginning. what that is. Got to be careful not to get spotted.
Come on! It's the description of Yiki's armband.
someone must be making that noise. Tell Gellon about the Kiki. Found your ship. And? Come on now, where are they? Where's my Yiki? I really don't know how to tell you this. Oh, for fuck's sake. Zeus could have impregnated the whole of Athens in the time it takes you to say anything. Where are they? They're dead, all right? And your ship's gone too. Oh, my Yiki. All I found is her armband. Yiki. I suppose I'm not much of a captain now. Can't be a captain without a ship. I'd best be on my way. You do that, Mistios. You may not be the cause, but nonetheless, you're the bringer of ill fate. If I never see you or that fucking oracle again, I'll count my blessings.
I can smell that my life. Death is coming for you, LP. What a shame. We would have made you rich before we killed you. Oh. Don't take it personally, Mysterious. Your mother is the one with you. Don't fight it. The cult always gets what it wants. Killing me is a mistake. Trusting you on Kefalonia was a mistake. I am the reason you left that island alive. The cult wanted you dead. What cult? Where are they? <laughs> <coughs> I found on Elpinor is like nothing I've ever seen. Might come in handy. Αθωότατο συνήθως, γιατί είναι δε.
This is the secret chamber. They're not ones for subtlety, are they? So, this is it. Hidden chamber of the cultists. Here, all along. I'm going inside. Keep my clothes for me. Best not to go in with your weapons, either. I don't think they'll look too kindly on that. How do I look? Terrifying. Good. Find me once you've found out the truth in there. Keep your wits about you. Try not to do anything rash. Me? Rash? Who thought these ridiculous costumes were a good idea? I think Vimos hasn't arrived yet. Sorry, it's my uh, first time. A new recruit? <gasps> welcome, welcome. There's a lot of people here. All share our common mind. Good. We're here to evaluate the strides taken by the cult since the last meeting. We haven't met for some, some time. Where did they come from? The land and across the seas, we assemble as a community. Here, there is no war. There are no sides. You mentioned someone. Vimos. Who is that? You'll learn her name very, very quickly. She's our leader. I'm sure she believes that, but no. She's our weapon. She's difficult, but she does important work for us. I don't envy her position one bit. I'll go talk to the others. Thank you. Yes, yes, before Demos comes. Who knows if you'll get a word in after that. right now, but who knows? Lemos may ask for our hands next. Go on, go on! Make your offering! We just have to keep our sights on what the bloodline will do for us. The bloodline? The mother, the father, the brother. You know, her kin. We need them. All of them. To use them? That information is not for Demos, of course. You know how volatile she is. She could rip through us easily. I'll be sure to keep it to myself. As you should. Nor can she know we're about to capture her mother. <laughs> Do what with her? I would lower my voice if I were you. Just know she will be put to good use, unless she's uncontrollable. You know where she is? No, but it won't be long until we do, I assure you. She's the cult's next target. Tell me about Vimos. She's shown us what we need to know. She's a machine, a weapon for the cult. Someone that unstable can't be trusted with such personal information. I have to go. To our great ambition. To ambition. I'll need much more information to identify who these cultists are. 
You're not listening. I'm still not convinced. You, we need another opinion on this. Why split the resources searching for a woman we can't find? If we narrow our focus, Athens will be ours. Immediate threats have to be destroyed. Pericles has to be destroyed. Not without the mother. We aren't strong enough without the mother. Don't let Vimos hear that. If anything, we should be hunting the father. <sighs> we know who the mother is. Looking for the father would be a waste of resources. What do you think? Hunt the champion's mother or her father? Neither. You have a better idea? The sibling, Alexios. He's as good as us already. We need to look to the future. No. Go after him. Now, if you'll excuse me. I hear you perfectly well. You're just wrong. We need to look for the father now. We can't have two minds about this. The cult must decide. yourself together, Malaka! You're a fucking pig before slaughter! I'll do it, I swear! I'll kill him! Let me go! You like to watch, you sick fuck! You're not just going to watch, you're going to teach this little insolent shit a lesson! Does he deserve it? Does it fucking matter, does it? What I say goes! No questions asked! I... I couldn't do it! But I'm not scared. Not anymore. If you can't kill a fucking artist, what are you gonna do when I tell you to kill a fucking Archon? I will! I will! I'll kill Phidias! I... Show him what happens to cowards. They get fucking burned! No. He's yours. Huh. You don't know what the fuck fun is. <laughs> More for me. <laughs> fuck with me and there's plenty more where that came from. Fuck up like that again and I'll draw blood. Now get the fuck out of here before I get this traitor's blood on your robes! You! Someone was spotted going into your house! Guards were found dead outside! Tell me who you talk to or I'll break your pretty face! Please! I beg you! He forced me! I thought he would kill me! He? I will kill you! What did you tell him? <laughs> <laughs> Speak, before I really give you something to cry about. I wish I could do something, but if I reveal myself now, this will all be for nothing. to and from the cult. Gods, they have a foothold in every part of the Greek world. We're in more danger than I thought. It's strange. I feel something towards the pyramid. It's covered in shards, like Alpinors.
Ah, you had the last piece. Now it is ready. Every time I see it, it calls to me and sings of power. Does it call to you like it calls to me? It does. It's impressive. Yes. Show your reverence. What we have now is everything. Ira has blessed me. My great warrior is leading our army to victory. Can you imagine the pride I feel? Our champion will destroy our enemies before they even think to kneel. Mark my words. Elpinor is dead. One of you is a traitor. The artifact will expose them. You! Oh. Everyone will be tested. You first. Go. You're alive. They know me. My family. 
They want my mother dead. I see. It's worse than I thought. There's more. They have a weapon. What kind? A soldier. Stronger and more ferocious than any I've ever seen. Herodotus, it's my sister. We need to get to Athens. Athens? We need to find my mother. My clothes. Spear. Uh, of course. My spear. The cult of Cosmos called my sister, Nemos. She used an artifact to see my memories. Alexios, the man I serve, we must tell him what's happened before it's too late. You've heard the name Pericles before. Pericles is the king of the free people of Athens. King? Athens has no king. Pericles serves the people, not the other way around. Serves the people? You're right. He's not much of a king. Save your doubts. He is working to end this war. We all are. If there are forces colluding against him, he must be warned. We have to go. To Athens? They're hunting my family, my mother. I have to find her. You carry the blade of Leonidas. Act like it. If Pericles doesn't put an end to this war, we're all as good as dead, including your mother. Fuck your war! The cultists are exterminating my family! You have a duty to the Greek world. We both do. Pericles must be warned. She is my mother. What would you have me do? If there is one place where we can find information about your mother, it is in Athens. How? Pericles surrounds himself with the brightest minds in Athens. Which is to say anywhere. In Athens, you can fulfill your duty to your family. Hmm. But before we can go, I need you to meet me at the Lion of Leonidas, at Thermobile. Leonidas? Why? There's something I need to know. Something that may help us take down this cult, and save your mother. You've proven I can trust you. But let's make it quick, Herodotus. First Thermopylae, then we go to Athens. Make sure every single one of these cultists dies by my hands.